movies and uh, not to be so much of a spoiler alert for that type of stuff but uh, Star, Wars, uh, Star, Wars, uh, Star Wars Episode 2 uh, was a, a movie I didn't really like uh, a whole lot to be honest even though I did kind of grow up on that movie uh, I enjoyed like the, the Jedi battles and stuff like that it, it wasn't really a movie I was very into really uh, the story is pretty bad <laughs> very lengthy, but there are some definitely really cool, um, key moments in that movie, obviously, you know, like the, uh, um, arena battle with all the Jedi, even the end battle with Anakin versus Count Dooku, you know, really cool things to see, but, uh, just the movie as a whole is pretty terrible, um, but yeah, this is actually, you guys, well, you guys are seeing the first actual gameplay me playing Star Wars Battlefront 2 in, oh, I don't know, maybe two months. Like I said, I don't really play Star Wars Battlefront 2 anymore unless I'm filming a video. So again, the last time I played this game was when I played it for you guys, which was about two months ago. Um, so sorry if my aiming is trash. Sorry if I don't use the abilities the right way. Uh, it's just kind of how it is from now on. But uh, I've been thinking about doing a um, tier. I know some people who are, you know, 
subscribed with the bell on and everything like that. They don't even get notifications for some of my videos during this time of year. It, it just really sucks. So I'm not really too worried about it now. Right now I'm just sort of experimenting with my channel and hopefully in the summertime where it usually starts um, kicking off again, I'll have some more different content ideas for you, 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 you watching this video. Um, obviously it's going to turn into more when, you know, the NBA playoffs start and, you know, new games come out, new topics to talk about, this and that. Uh, it'll be better. And also with, um, you know, things starting to open up again, I really, really, really want to experiment more with, um, like, IRL, ASMR. channel but i really want to do more you know i really want to go out to in, in, into stores sports stores gaming stores uh maybe just go out on like a, a, a hike a nature walk and do asmr out there i think that'd be really cool those are i love those types of asmr videos um even like the next time i go to like like disneyland or the beach or something like that i think that would be really cool i really enjoy those type of asmr videos um where you're just sort of out and about it's sort of like nice calming background noise and stuff like that that's just my, 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 my opinion, I guess, but uh, now you guys are about to see um, some completely embarrassing uh, Darth Maul gameplay, which, like I said before, I don't use Darth Maul at all. Uh, I know, you know, when Darth Maul got into the game, when he was always been in the game, when before he had his block ability and everything, that, that was really bad, but now he's a little bit more easy to use, but as you can see, I completely forget, like, what his abilities are how to use his abilities, um, it's pretty funny, I'm not gonna lie, but, uh, I, I, I just really love playing the, uh, CPU in this game, it really makes you feel like a total animal, it makes you feel like you're, you're actually the character in the game, it makes you feel very powerful, which is really dope, um, I do also forget, though, that the CPU in this game is so game I really you know was playing a lot of um I tried getting back into um Overwatch for a little bit there but uh I don't know man there's just <laughs> there's just no really good games out and obviously 2k sucks 2k is just not fun this year for me at all last year's 2k was pretty bad but even that game I played a whole lot of obviously making um, a lot of content for you guys but even now I I, I really just haven't really been playing much of anything um, in this one we are going to be playing as the Resistance, those are the, um, good guys in episodes 7 through 9, and as you can see, my Finn is pretty unused, he's only level 14, which I guess is not that bad, it's halfway to like the highest, well not the highest level, but to the peak level, which is 30, so I can get the other leveling up cards and whatnot, um, and even also, Chewbacca is a very high level, but ever since his, um, his nerf, uh, I haven't really used, been using him a whole lot, his blaster sucks now, I still really love his shock grenade, and it's really good against, uh, heroes and heroes versus villains, but besides that, if I'm ever playing a, uh, an actual game game, I'm really ever playing Chewbacca, and then we have BB-8 here, which, um, again, I've probably played maybe the amount of times I can count on my hand, like it's maybe been 
three, four, five times I played BB-8, and it's not that I don't like the character, I'm just not really good at it, it's not, like, fun for me, I guess, um, it's not bad, I actually really understand why it's in the game, but, um, it's just not my thing, I guess, but, um, also, I also just realized I have never, ever, 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 ever played on this co-op map before, it's actually so, 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 so cool to look at, um, and, and especially when I'm playing, uh, you know, co-op, when you're going against the CPU, really cool when you just get to mow down a bunch of, you know, stormtroopers or droids and stuff like that. It's really, really, really dope. Um, but obviously, you know, I'm really just trying to stock up to get some uh, hero points right now. Uh, and I think the best case scenario for me to do right now is the gunner. I think that's his name, the gunner, um, which is just a Gatling gun, uh, crazy maniac that uh, has some pretty I obviously just love his his mowing down ability with his with his blaster, which is really dope to see. Um, especially when you're on a map that has very long, you know, corridors and hallways and tight turns and stuff. It's really nice to play this uh, to play this character, especially when you use his double 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 bumpers. Uh, it extends his ability right there. He has a tackling ability for close quarters. It's it's a really nice character. Is pretty over overpowered, I'm not gonna lie. But um, also the other character for the resistance, the uh oh, I don't even know what to really call him. The other one, the pistol guy, who has the craziest ability with the uh I I don't even really know what to call it. It's kinda like an AC one thirty but for for Star Wars Battlefront terms, but uh, it's really cool. Strike. I think I was, yeah, orbital strike. That orbital strike ability, ability, ability is super dope. Um, but obviously, I can't use orbital strike in a ship or in any undercover area, so it's very limited to maps and, and usage. But man, when you use it and you use it good, and, and a bunch of enemies get hit by it, it's really dope uh, to see that. So it's really cool. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty much clearing house right now. Uh, this character is, is, is pretty much a an instant, instant, instant money maker, as you can see. I'm, I'm racking up a bunch of points, and like I said, I don't really like the heroes on resistance, um, I think Ray is good, but like I said, I, I, I just can't really use her a whole lot anymore, um, right now I'm sticking with my gutter also because I hear that Kylo Ren, uh, spawned in, so if you didn't know, um, after a certain point, the enemy team gets a hero, which is actually, um, kind of terrifying, <laughs> No, this isn't some sort of, um, I don't know, just random computer that's running around. He, he, I can, can get pretty tough and, and kill, you know, heroes on your own team and stuff like that. So, um, you really gotta watch out for this one. So, we actually double team in there, which is really good. Um, and also, just my character can just shred through basically anyone. And it's a really good character. As you can see right here, man, it's just, if you just get all of the enemy team in front of you, you just slowly move back and forth to target to target and just keep it going i get my aim it's pretty bad uh it's my first, it's my second game playing in two weeks so i feel like i'm getting a hang of it a little bit more right here i'm definitely getting a bit too cold and i get really lucky there um i'm not even really sure why i stuck with the, the gunner so long but i ended up uh respawning to get a hero which as you guys can see um bb8 very 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 low level i'm just gonna go out here and see how he does uh, this is a very close quarters part of the map so maybe it will help me out a little bit being bb8 but i don't know let's give it a try as you can see i'm just shocking some people as i'm running through here nothing too bad and right here i try to do something probably pretty stupid um and i'll tell you why <laughs> uh we just discussed that the CPU has intense aimbot, and if you're out in the open, it'll just, you know, headshot you completely uh, into oblivion. So, obviously, when playing BB-8 or BB-9E, um, you know, the small target's harder to hit, but if you're a CPU shooting at something you can just aimbot on, uh, it doesn't really matter now, does it? So I switch over to Finn, and with Finn, he's more of a accuracy type of, of character, which again, I'm just getting Reese, you know, comfortable with the uh, aiming and the 
game and stuff like that. I also keep pulling up his ability list because I have no idea what it does at all. So that's definitely fun. I get a nice long corridor. corridor. This would be good for the uh, gunner. And right here, Emperor Palpatine just shows up. This is actually a very tight quarter for a, uh, a checkpoint. It's just kind of right slap dab in the middle. Ray sort of uh, is a nice, nicely puppy guarding with me. Um, I do remember Dead Eye being a really good ability, especially when you're facing off against CPU or just regular infantry. Uh, I do remember it's a pretty good ability. I never really liked his, his right bumper ability though. It was kind of off. It wasn't really that cool or really anything like that, but Finn is pretty nice. Um, Finn is definitely more of a, uh, uh, like I said, like a, a CPU infantry style of hero. I could not imagine playing as Finn during like heroes versus villains or uh, anything like that. He's, in that case, I think he's probably pretty useless. I'd rather use Chewie or even Han. I think Han is probably the most OP of the blasters. I'm sure you guys have seen those TikToks of Han Solo. Um, compilations of just being an absolute demon <laughs> in the game. Pretty crazy. Um, but I feel like I'm doing pretty good so far. We're definitely moving up the uh, checkpoints pretty fast, and I think this is the last one. But as you see right here, it's it's very much heavily guarded. It's pretty terrifying. And across the way there we have um, Miss Captain Phasma, um, which is pretty terrifying. You can see her Troy there. One of my teammates actually runs over there and gets at her, which is dope, but um, I wish Finn had some sort of a, a grenade ability, which would be nice. But our PVH droid destroys the uh, little droid over there. And right here, I try to try to get to work. I try to get as many people as I can, using all of my abilities to their hopefully true potential. But this map, this map is is super dope. I, I, again, I don't think I've ever, 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 ever played on this map before. It's really, really, really cool looking. Um, it is sort of. star uh, but also sort of a new pizzazz to it sort of a, something that looks a little bit cooler um i don't know if this came out around the same time as the last movie which i think came out last year episode nine um which is totally crazy to think about that movie came out you know over a year ago um, i think that was one of the last movies i remember seeing in, in a movie theater ever um, which is totally crazy to think about now as Know, playing as Finn, I'm not gonna be, you know, at the head of the head of the helm here, or not even in the checkpoint to capture it. I'm gonna be sort of on the outskirts, just trying to pick down as many of these guys as I possibly can, and uh, you know, running in and out of the checkpoint area as I can when it's safe. Just trying to take care of the, the sort of outskirts, and getting a nice angle like this one right here, very nice angle, not letting them really get any high ground. Um, again, I, I really think Finn should get a grenade. Um, I think Chewie's grenade, or even the, just any of the Wookiee grenades, are uh, are super overpowered. Um, I also really enjoy the Super Battle Droid Rocket. I love that ability, um, and I also really enjoy, um, obviously, the Gunner ability and the um, the Death Trooper ability is also super dope to see as well. Um, but yeah, pretty 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 dope. We're doing pretty good so far, as you can see, Kylo. <laughs> over there and uh, obviously being Finn I do not want anything to do with Kylo um, pretty terrifying to think about that but uh, these guys are really starting to get up everywhere and uh, trying to try to get me down but I, I'm picking them off pretty good like I said getting a good angle playing as Finn is really 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 important on on multiplayer hero versus villain CPU fighting um, getting a good angle and using his distance is very 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 good right here I get kind of close because I activate my sort of dead eye ability um, to just give it a bunch of shots in as I can and then try to make my way back out. I actually almost died there. It's pretty terrifying, jeez. But as you can see, we're, we're, kind of, we're kind of losing the point there. I have no idea where our ray or anyone really is. Um, even the gunner ability or gunner character would be really good for us right now. But I'm just gonna take more initiative and go 
clearing this area out right here. As you can see, and I level up actually two levels to level 16. I didn't even catch the first one. There's Kyla right there. Super duper terrifying. But uh, just making sure he doesn't really stand away is good. But uh, Kylo is actually downstairs. And then he's running back upstairs. <laughs> I sort of uh, miss him right there. It's kind of funny. And I know Finn is actually kind of an OP character. Oh wow, I almost got 100. That's crazy. Uh, pretty OP character against CPU. But anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching my video. I always appreciate it. Make sure you guys check out the video I'm posting on later on tonight. Make sure to remember. Make sure to like. Make sure to subscribe. And hopefully I'll be back with you guys with another.